Okay, now I'm gonna show you the bloopers for that fucking, for yesterday, uh, last week's video. For that, um, I fixed this part with super glue. So, yeah. Let's get into it. Now here's something you've never seen me have before. This is a 4040 China Steel Katana. Simple as that. I'm currently wearing my shoes because I was just outside training with this. Now this is a tutorial of how to spin your sword in the air like Jet Scream Sam did in Metal Gear Rising Revenge. the hit game from 2013. <laughs> oh, fuck. Firstly, you're going to take it out of the scabbard. You're going to place your thumb about anywhere on the side of the blade, then it'll spin. Let's give it a, a quick fucking... Okay, so a better way to do this, let me put my scabbard down, is to two-hand it, for a better example. Um, I'm putting my thumb like right here, so on the Right, like the, so at the back of the handle, I have my thumb. More importantly, my actual fully closed hand, my fully closed right hand, as your left hand goes on the bottom for to balance your swings. So, okay, place your thumb to the right of it, not to the left, to the right, because then you can flick it outwards, like this, such as this. See, I'm failing a few times, but still. Once you get it, you got it. You want the back of the blade facing towards you, you want the front facing towards whatever it's facing. Never like this. You don't want the blade facing you. It'll look really fucking stupid. Or, alternatively, you could also do it like this. So, what I'm doing is I have my four fingers on the front of the handle. And then I have my thumb up top beneath the suba, which is the handle guard. And then I'm just doing this. I'm using those four fingers to kind of launch it up in the air. Honestly, my room doesn't have enough space to be fucking swinging this around unless I'm facing the wall where my bed is. So, I don't have a lot of room to train here, which is why I go out back. Because it's kind of secluded, but still. Anyway. So a quick disclaimer, this is a katana. It is made from 4040 China steel. I am a professional. I have been training with this for about two to three months now. I believe two, one or two actually, I think. I know how it works. Don't worry. I am up for... Okay, I'm still training with... God damn it. I knocked a bottle of hand sanitizer off my... Bedside table. <laughs> I have two of those actually. One of them you've probably seen in one of my older videos in this room. Anyway, as I was saying, I have enough experience with this that I know what I'm doing. So anyway, goddamn. This is a katana. It is made from 4040 China steel. Stainless, I think. No, it's, it's rusted. At the, it's rusted somewhere around here. I am professional. Not exactly, still a trainee, technically, but I don't go anywhere to train. Like a place. But still, okay. I have had enough experience with this for about a month or two. I'm fine. I have not cut myself, except for 
taking the end cap off here to tighten it, to tighten the handle. This is half tang, not full tang, so it's meant for more of this, uh, <laughs> God damn it! I keep knocking shit. 